Despite the announcement by the Israeli Ministry of Education of a gradual return to school from the 1st to the 3rd year in addition to the 11th and 12th from May the 4th, classes remained empty in Christian schools. We've sanitized the building, preparing the classroom and everything. Not only in this school, but in all the schools in Jerusalem and in all our schools, in Haifa, Acre, Ramle and Jaffa. All the schools are ready to welcome students, but parents are very afraid to send their children to school. The school is open, as you can see. The administrative staff and some teachers are here, but the students have not come. Parents claim that the risk is too high. Everyone cares about their children, I understand, and I respect that. The absence of students was no surprise to the administration. As you can see, we sent parents a questionnaire asking them what they thought about the decision to reopen the schools. The result is as follows. 29 were against, while only 4 were in favour. But even those 4, as you see, did not come today. The Minister of Education asked the schools not to accept any student who does not have a certificate signed by his parents stating the following three conditions. Neither the student nor his family members are positive for coronavirus. Every day the body temperature is measured before coming to school. The parents take responsibility for the health of the boy even while he is at school. Three conditions that have increased the parents' fear. It's not easy for families. Of course it is difficult for them to get their children back to school. Because they are worried, they are afraid. At this moment, many of the families are opposed to returning to school because the situation is not yet completely under control. Meanwhile, distance learning continues. We did all the simulations for the final exam online and that was a great result. Also, our students didn't miss their classes. We take lessons online. They're very effective and we have great teachers. We've also done some online exam simulations. We did the exams well and the teachers did their best. After each test, they answered all our questions. It was a good experience. We studied the teaching materials as thoroughly as possible and so we prepared for the ministerial exam. Despite the lack of students and the fear of parents, the optimism of the children of the Terra Sancta schools has not disappeared, not even in the face of the coronavirus pandemic. Their attention is focused on the goals to be achieved. In the end, life must go on. We will respect the health instructions and the instructions of the Minister of Health. The school will do its part as well.